Hello there, this is Welsh ASMR 82. Hey, how you doing? So, I've been, well, I always try to read and respond to as many comments as I can. I used to do every single comment, but then this channel got a little bit too big for that. But I log on every day and try to answer a couple of comments. And I've noticed quite a few of you asking for this series to be re reinstated, restarted, whatever you want to call it. And this is the series of videos where I'd look at the world on uh, Google Maps. Google Maps. And in particular, you've asked me to continue the series on the United States of America. So that's what we're going to do today. I really hope that you find this ASMR video relaxing, that's the whole point of ASMR. But also if you find it kind of interesting and fun, then all's the better. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy the video. So if you don't know the format, I basically zoom in and we look at some random places. I'm gonna start, I always start over here on the uh, east coast. Let's start somewhere here. I think I ignore this middle section. Far too much. So, Arkansas. I don't think I've ever zoomed in on Arkansas. Little Rock. I've got my different pen today, he says, and then it doesn't actually work. So Little Rock, College Station, Sweet Home, Landmark, Crystal Hill, some nice sounding names around here. Oh, it's pretty. So we got Murray Lake there, and then I can't, oh, Arkansas River, and then the David T. Terry Lake it flows into. The Arkansas River carries on, look how many different, what are they called in English, tributaries. Lots of geographers watching this program. I'm a linguist, I'm not a geographer. I just happen to love geopolitics and uh, world maps and flags. So, Bill and Hillary Clinton National Airport, Midtown Reservoir, West Markham, Briarwood, Boyle Park, Oak Forest, oh, Oak Forest sounds nice, Downtown, South End, The Old Mill, Apple Valley, some really pretty sounding names here. So we've got Capital View, um, Oak Forest, oh, let's go into downtown, shall we? So you've got the uh, William J. Clinton Library and Museum. Three floors of exhibits and memorabilia related to Clinton's life and presidency. So is he from, is he an Arkansas resident then? Or resident? Um, was he originally from the area? Oh yeah, obviously, Bill Clinton, William. <laughs> I was like, who's William J. Clinton? Idiot. So that's a mock-up of the White House. I've got a very clicky <laughs> wrist at the minute. It's all the painting in my new house. I've damaged my wrist. Very cool building, I like it. Oh, does he play sax? Hmm. So that's the museum. But we've got a different one here, the Museum of Discovery. I love fun museums like this. I used to go to them when I was a kid. There's one in Cardiff. We used to go on school trips too. Museum of Disco. Oh. <laughs> I literally thought I said Disco. Very. Museum of Disco. Very fun. Discovery. The Wow Gallery. Nice T Rex by the looks of it. Bloodstream. Your bones are in your feet. Yeah, there's like a ridiculous number of bones. 
arms and your feet compared to the rest of your body. Uh, triceratops. I know my dinosaurs. <laughs> That's such a cool picture. I love places like that. Okay. Where else should we look at? Little Rock. It has to do with the, the bridge. Nice. Captured photo. Photo. Time captured. Is that bridge able to able to move or is it just stationary? It looks like it would have been able to open at one point. Junction bridge. La Petite Roche. Little Rock. That's a very artsy photo. I like that. Artsy photo, I said. Junction bridge. Original construction 1884, pedestrian use conversion 2008. Oh, really? So as late as that? I think we saw that. references to Clinton. I don't suppose every town has a president of the United States come from it. I, I'm assuming here that either there's some <laughs> bizarre obsession with him or he was from Little Rock. I'm going to go with the latter. Interstate, park, ball fields, ball field reservations, Arkansas State Fair and the Barton Coliseum. Agua Fria. 
Museum of International Folk Art. Georgia O'Keeffe Museum. Rotating exhibits of the work of Georgia O'Keeffe include paintings, sculptures and sketches. Field, Fort Marcy Recreation Complex, or oh, the swimming pool. Sometimes forget that it can actually get cold enough to snow this far south. I doubt it snows that often. New Mexico governor's residence. Adobe Gallery. That is gorgeous, this picture, wait for it. I love the doors. Very, um, Spanish colonialism type building. Hmm. From the outside, but then not inside actually. It's more native people actually. That's cool. I'd like to go there. I love all the street names being in Spanish. It reminds me of living back in Spain. Santa Re, Santa Fe, excuse me, really hard.
Should we go northeast or just east? Let's go. Yeah, I tend not to go too often down here. Should we go to Tallahassee, Panama City, Charleston? I've done Charleston, Augusta, Wilmington, I've done, I think. Norfolk. Shall we do Richmond? I don't think I've done Richmond ever. Mechanicsville. Montrose. Carillon. God knows how it's pronounced. Marion Hill, Fulton Hill. Churchill. Lots of hills. Virginia State Capital, grand colonial style structure built in 1785, housing the nation's oldest legislative body. That's pretty. inside as well. Wow, that's a beautiful building. It seemed like reaching for the moon. Barbara Red Johns. with the solemnity of the occasion for which I must say I was not prepared. I accept the position assigned to me, assigned me by your partiality. I would have pre much preferred had your choice fallen on an ampler man. Trusting in Almighty God and approving conscience and the aid of my fellow citizens, I devote myself to the service of my native state in whose behalf alone I will I ever again draw my sword. You know what that is? I didn't say. Beautiful building. The Valentine. Circa eighteen twelve landmark house turned museum with exhibits and artifacts exploring Richmond's history. I love these old colonial buildings. They are beautiful. The big veranda and the large windows. That red brick and the columns. Yeah, it's gorgeous. It's a lovely house. Staircase, wow. Conference room, statue. The statue. I have an obsession with clocks. Chandelier. Dining room. So if that's, so let's see, the White House of the Confederacy. The largest Confederate collection, interpretive exhibits and tours of the Confederate White House. So am I really missing the mark here when they say Confederate White House? They mean the Confederate, oh, I can't remember my American history. Is that like the South, the Confederate flag, that sort of thing? I can't remember 
the flags now, it's not the Virginia flag. So North Carolina. Okay, we'll try and sneak in a fourth place because I don't usually get to four. far fewer large cities. Rocky Point, Aladdin, Bula. I think there's a Bula in Wales. Devil's Tower, it's like a sneaky peek. I feel it's very small, so we probably won't see that much. Oh yes, yeah, absolutely tiny. What was that? Very idyllic. Devil's Tower Visitor Center. And the Devil's Tower Na National Monument. So, like, was it a volcano at some point? It looks like it would have been. Devil's Tower, known to many as Bear Lodge, is a unique geologic wonder that is a sacred site for many American Indians, native peoples. Once hidden below the Earth's surface, the tower was revealed as the Bell Fourche River eroded away softer rock layers over millions of years. Gosh, it was not a volcano then, potentially. So you can register to climb it. That's a good note to leave it on. Okay, so 
get your comments in, answer any of the questions that I've had today, and recommend some places for me to visit in the next edition. I'll try and do another one in the next month. And also I mentioned earlier on about Patreon, um, there are two videos extra, one map video and one ramble video per month. And every single video on this channel is early release to my patrons as well. So check out the info below. Click like if you enjoyed the video and leave a little comment, subscribe if you're new. And I hope that you find it really relaxing at the very least. And in addition, if you found it interesting, fun, if I looked at any of your, uh, where, where you live or where you're from, then that would be really awesome. Drop me a comment. Okay, thanks so much. I really enjoyed it and I'll do it again very soon. Take care.